One out and a runner on third. Here comes the one two. Hard hit towards center. A dive, but it'll get past him out in center, and this could roll till tomorrow. And this will get to the wall now, out beyond the 385 sign. Coming in to score is the runner from third, and the Orioles have taken the lead. It's 1-0 here in the first. Well, there's one way to get our first run of the game across. Good hustle there on the RBI triple, and they're in good shape to possibly make it 2-0 with another base hit. A man at third with one away. Now the one-two. Inside with the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Yeah, I don't think this is a guy you want to mess with here. He can hurt you in more ways than one. Two-two. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. Well, after getting ahead here, 0-2, you know, he nibbles for a couple pitches and then finally just says, all right, I'm through with this. So he goes back to the fastball, just blows it right by him. Here's the catcher, Matt Wieters, now. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Here comes the 1-0. Now a swing and a ground ball, but a foul ball, one and one. One-one on the way. Reaches for one and slaps it down the line at third. Diving is Headley, but Chase comes up empty. It's a fair ball. And that'll plate their second run of the game as they take a 2-0 lead. Yeah, a great start for them so far. They go up 2-0 on a base hit here, and they're doing it off one of the best pitchers in the game. The 1-1. Now a ball lined towards center field. And that's in there, base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And they are on the board as the run scores from second to make this a 2-1 game now. That's a great example of one teammate picking up another there. But after the guy before him struck out, couldn't drive to run it, he gets him off the hook here by knocking in the run with two away. Now the 1-2. Now a swing and a little tapper that could wind up problematic down that third baseline. And a rather easy first out. Yeah, he might have thought about going to third for just a split second there. But with nobody out, I think the smart decision was to go ahead and take... Garrett Jones will stand in now. He singled and struck out in two trips. Here's the first offering. Now a swing as he shoots this one over to first. A throw to the plate. A tag from Weeters, and he is out trying to score. But wisely, no thought of a return throw, and the inning will continue. That runner at third is going on contact there. That's got to be the only way to explain it. It's one thing if this ball's hit up the middle, but when you hit it right at a corner infielder, you got to figure he's coming home with it. They get Here's Didi Gregorius as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. You know, maybe the most impressive thing about his performance so far, he's doing it all in a hitter's ballpark. But it's hard to come in here and pitch like this, but he's done a heck of a job. He's ready now, the pitch. And this is hit well towards the hole. Look at the stop. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. And he's safe. This is a case where a guy's trying to do a little too much. That's a great play to dive and get to this ball, but then he tries to make a superhuman throw and the ball just takes off on him.
a fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Nervous time now in that third base dugout. Heck, nervous time up here. My heart's racing and I'm just watching this game. Here comes the 1-0. Cold strike at the knees, 1-1. One and, one. and that's about where he'll sit with that fastball, 93-94. That's plenty hard enough to blow up by guys when you need to. Now the 1-1. And here's a ball hit in the air. Machado will have plenty of room as he makes the catch, and there's a big out number two. Here's that swing again. This is in show motion. And mm, you'll see that that's a few inches above the thumbs. He'll be feeling that one all night long. Jacoby Ellsbury will step in. One for four in the ballgame. First pitch coming. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. Well, you can tell he's trying to work that pitch away, but he might have left that one a little more over the plate than he intended. Now the pitch home to Ellsbury. And a good spot for that pitch is it's chopped foul. Now the pitch. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Here's the one, two. And he struck him out for out number three. So that'll wrap things up here as they leave the possible tying run stranded at first. Yeah, you know, this game kind of felt like it could have been played back in 1968. Very well played, very low scoring, very quick game too. I'll tell you, I could go for a few more of these this year. That'd be okay by me.